Hi, my name is Angus and I'm from C2 Communications and today I'm just going to show you how to create a digital receptionist on your 3CX management console. So first let's just go over to the digital receptionist tab and then click add. Now here we are, we can give it a name. So let's just call this main DR. So we have the option to record, so let's go down and click record. And all you do is you chuck a name in, so we're going to call this main DR. If you were to record the prompt now, you would receive a call, but let's just cancel it because we've already recorded a prompt and I've called it test DR. So let's just type it in the drop down box there. And now it has been selected, we can move down to the rest of our options. So now let's just scroll down to our menu options where we can choose where we would like calls to go if the user presses a certain button on their keypad. So there's a few different options we can choose. You can end the call, however that's not very useful, so let's just go through the other options. You can send them to an extension, or if you've created a ring group, you can send them there. You even have the option to send them to a call queue, another digital receptionist, or even an extension's voicemail. However, for this example, let's send number one to the call queue we created earlier, and let's send number two to our main extension. If we scroll down, we can see that there's a few other options. We can choose where the call will go if there is no input within 60 seconds. So let's just choose it to repeat the prompt so that we don't lose any calls. And then if the input is invalid, let's leave it to repeat the prompt again. So let's just click OK to save that digital receptionist. And there we have it, it's all done. Thank you very much for listening and I hope you have a great day.